Shocking as shit, I know. Need to get to Skellige. Not on this boat, you won't. Pay you well. The islanders live off plunder in the seas. Not willing to risk that. Ever sailed there? Listen, the islanders attack all ships. When they hate someone, Nilfgaard, for instance, they attack him more. But truth be told, not much more. Oh, did me once. Expect they wanted to see if I had captain's bollocks. That spot of fun gave me enough Skelliger for a lifetime. This deck's to shine like the silver on the Emperor's table. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe not. Hey, Whitey. Why'd your hair go white? Tub. What's it to you? How much would it cost me to hire this ship? The Harmony of Nations ain't for hire. Ship's owners got plans for it. There anyone in Novigrad who'll take me to Skellige? You mean anyone here off their gourd? Aye, Wolverston. Goes by the name of Flask. Ask at the Golden Sturgeon. Man's a sheep bugger, like the Skelligers. Sure they get along great. Captain of the Atropos. So you want to know if I'm Atropos, Captain of the Wolverston? No fucking clue, mate. I need to get to Skellige. My Atropos and me, we're due to sail for our Skellig, carrying grain. But that's our shush. Got any coin? Gotta get more coin. You sure do. 
For I won't even whip me horse in a bath without payment in advance. When I'm done with you, you'll scream. You're back. Got the coin. Here, that enough? Sack, like a bulls. When do we sail? Not sure you're ready. You can barely stand. Know this, stranger. Captain Wolverston never sails sober. The sea goes one way, Wolverston the other. Makes the rock unbearable. So, ready to set sail? Let's go. Ah, first, we must drink to the wind, to good fortune. To the strength of my Atropos. <sighs> Anchors away! Back off or I'll kill you. <laughs> I'm not afraid of dying. Rob every corpse that washes up on shore. Taken from a corpse ain't theft. I'm a man of the isles. I don't reap, I don't sow. The waves bring me my harvest. 
On the Atropos, were you? Yeah. Thought the captain had a deal with you. With us? Meaning who exactly? Might have arranged something with Lugos, but crack? Nay. Clearly should have, though. Outlander ships aren't welcome in these waters. What about you? What do you seek in Skellige, eh? Agreed to meet a sorceress here. Yennefer of Vengerberg. She's supposed to be on Ord Skellig. There's a witch at Kertrolda. Croc's guest. Could be the one you're meeting. That scorn I hear in your voice. You've good ears. Folks say this witch got Croc wrapped around her finger. Orders everyone about. Word is she's vicious at it. But a hag's a hag. Seen her? Know what the sorceress looks like? Aye. Where's black and white? If not for her tits, you think she was a beached orca? Fact is, even those who see her for a wench would gladly push her out to sea, tits and all. What's your name? Stangrim. Well, Stangrim, I don't like you. In fact, I feel like slapping you. Go ahead, Drifter. You try. Had enough? Best finish me now, because you'll be fucked once I catch my breath. It was a good fight. That's enough for now. Know the way to Kertrolda? Expect I'll find it. Head north. Then turn west towards the bay before you come to the bridge. You'll find the Jarl port site today. Your sorceress ought to be there too. Thanks. So long. Come on, Roach. smile upon you. Best wares in the oils, the very ah. best. Hey. Every man on the hey. continent so bloodless. Everything fresh the as a daisy. Lurk in the highlands. Well, what is it?
Last night was... Oof. Come on, trim it. Scotty, ready. Why can't I play today, Dad? We've got to go to the port and bid farewell to King Bran. It's not fitting to play either. Who will be King of Skellig and I? Don't know that. But the gods will make sure to be one worthy. One before who it will be no shame to bow. The king's <laughs> passing. <laughs> Our time amongst the living is but the wink of an eye. What's left when we are gone? How shall we be remembered? Will they speak of us? You need not do this, child. I know. But I want to. This madness. Such a young lass. Erna should be the one going. They shared a bed longer. Silence. It is her decision. You look beautiful. Thank you. Nice to see you again. The eulogy. King Bran of Clan Twirsech has embarked on his final voyage. At its end, our glorious ancestors await him. Together they will hunt and raid. They will sit round the fire and praise the deeds 
of ages past. For now, he lives in our hearts. One day, we too shall stand at his side and face the sea together. That will be a good day. You knew Bran? Yes. He was well respected. Unlike his wife. Skellige is its clans. In times of war, tradition holds the clans unite under the leadership of their king. We bid Bran farewell. Time to pick his successor who will lead us against the Black Ones. The gates of Caer Troll stand open to all who hail Bran of Clan Twilsach dear. Mead and meat will be plentiful. During the wake, those who believe themselves worthy of the crown will step forth. Come to the wake with me. Gladly. Feasts in Skellige, so predictable. Snobbering drunks, brazen boasting, and the inevitable rows that result. Yeah, nothing like the banquets mages attend. Remember the one on Thanid? You were there. How could I forget? I also remember excruciatingly well what happened after the banquet. Reading my mind again? Mm. What's more, I like what I see. Did you learn anything in Velen? Velen. Awful place. Somehow Ciri wound up at the castle of the local ruler, a baron, self-proclaimed. This was after she was injured. Injured? Was it serious? Don't think so. Must have recovered because this baron sent her on to Novigrad. Think she was looking for you at the time. These witches Ciri came across, she was lucky to escape them. Witches? Creatures more like. Can't say exactly what they are, but they're dangerous. Very. Also ran into an old friend of ours in Velen, Kira. What on earth is Kira Metz doing in that wasteland? Hiding from witch hunters. Listen, she told me an elven mage had been there looking for Ciri. Good. You'll need to tell me more when we have some time. Been to Novigrad. Ciri was there, looking for a way to lift some curse. She's not there anymore. You're certain? Heard it from Dandelion with no embellishments. Do you know any more about this curse? Not much. Ciri ran into some trouble, never finished what she went there to do. I recovered a phylactery. She was looking for a way to enchant it. I'll look at it later. How about you? What have you learned? Something strange happened on Ard Skellig a time ago. A disaster brought about by a burst of magic. Extraordinary, really. Natural anomaly. Never seen anything like it. My intuition tells me Syria was its cause. As much as I respect your intuition, Yen, we need something specific. Evidence. I'd know for certain if I was able to inspect the disaster zone. Unfortunately, Ermion and his druids aren't letting anyone near. Ermion's head of the Skellige Circle? Haven't seen him since... Um... Since Syria was a little girl. I doubt he'll do you any favors, not even for old time's sake. So why won't Ermion let you inspect the area of the anomaly? Call it a difference of opinion. A large, loud difference. Look, it's Krach. Wait, Wolf. Greetings, Krach. I shall see you at the wake, and I'll not accept any excuses. I have an important matter to discuss with you. I shall wear black and white for the feast. I count on you to don something complimentary. Something that doesn't reek of a thousand hunts. 
Yen, you know I can't stand new doublets. Just too tight till you break them in. And just like Krug, I'll not accept any excuses. We're not here to enjoy ourselves. We've matters to resolve and should dress appropriately. I've rented a room at the inn. Took the liberty of laying out some clothes for you there. You ought to go. Choose something. In the meantime, I have something to attend to. We'll meet at the entrance to the feast hall. Last night was 